the Climate Action Army, led by young people, is unstoppable. They are larger, they are louder, and they assure you they are not going away, and I stand with them. Excellencies, the science is clear. We know what to do. First, we must keep the goal of 1.5 degrees Celsius alive. This requires greater ambition on mitigation and the immediate concrete action to reduce global emissions by 45 percent by 2030. G20 countries have a particular responsibility as they represent around 80 percent of emissions. According to the principle of common but differentiated responsibilities, in light of national circumstances, developed countries must lead the effort. But the emerging economies too must go the extra mile, as their contribution is essential for the effective reduction of emissions. We need maximum ambition from all countries on all fronts to make Glasgow a success. I urge developed countries and the emerging economies to build coalitions to create the financial and technological conditions to accelerate the carbonization of the economy as well as the phase out of coal. These coalitions are meant to support the large emitters that face more difficulties in the transition from grey to green for them to be able to do it.